Hello and welcome to Plus Sports on Plus TV Africa, Wednesday, the middle of the week. Or for some people, it's just almost the middle of the week. But it's the middle of the work week, so we bring you some of the latest stories from around the world. I know many of you have already enjoyed your night prior and you're looking forward to more Champions League football tonight. We have uh, some stories on that and Chelsea did win handsomely against the Milan team that went down to 10 men. We'll discuss that very soon. But there's a new, it's a new day in the NFF as it was a landmark moment at the Nigerian Football Federation office on Tuesday morning as FIFA Council member and member of the CAF Executive Committee, Amaju Melvin Pinnock, formally handed over the reins of the NFF to the winner of the presidential election at the September 30th elective general assembly held in Benin City, Alaji Ibrahim Musa Gusau. Pinnock charged the management and staff to give Gusau and the new board maximum support as they gave him and his team and reiterated that he remained part of the system and would still be available to offer advice and suggestions whenever such is sought. This election nearly didn't happen as there was a court order that said it couldn't happen, but the executive committee went ahead with it anyway. There might still be a challenge to come along the way, as there always seems to be when it comes to our Nigerian Football Federation. Eventually, Gusau may have to deal with those uh, not-so-happy parties that try to stop the whole election. But on paper, he has won, and he has stepped into the role now. We can only wish him good luck and that he manages to do better than the previous administration. No matter where you stand on Pinnock's uh, term in office, we always wish that the next leader does better than the old one.